Hey guys, Jay here with BTP again. I'm going to show you a split squat isolation, uh, which is going to kind of test your hips and uh, a lot of your ankle stability. The depth in which you go down to this position is going to be up to you. So if you have the mobility, uh, so for those of you that are good with split squats, if you have the ankle mobility, you're more than welcome to go a little bit deeper. Uh, for the first little bit, and the one I'm going to demonstrate is going to be kind of at uh, about 45 degrees uh, of, of hip and uh, knee flexion. So, in this position, right, so if you get into kind of a split squat or, or a one-legged squat, you want to be able to stabilize at the hip, right, to not let the hip come out to the side. So, when you drop down, whatever position you feel you want to get into, your weight should be mostly on this leg. You should feel your leg holding you in place. Because you're gonna bring this foot in, and then you're gonna come out at an angle. Bring it in, come out to the side. Bring it in, to the front, and then all the way to the front. The whole time I want my body to be in place, okay? Now, once you get good with that, okay, or once you feel that that's easy enough, what you can do is do kind of a clock motion as in the second hand, right, or the minute hand, or I guess the hour hand, if you don't really want to argue about it, right? So my goal is to hold my body in place here as I'm swinging the leg around and come back. Now what you're gonna notice is, as you're coming back or going towards the back position, your knee is gonna to wanna to drop in, especially as it starts to fatigue, right? So, if I show you my knee here, right, I'm getting down into my partial split squat position. As I come out, right, as I try to bring this leg out, sometimes that knee is gonna wanna cave in. Or, if you kinda start getting tired and the body starts getting a little bit lazy. So, hold that position as your leg moves, right? The goal is to keep it in that position. So if I show you sideways, right, for those of you that can tolerate that knee coming